Protesters gathered near parliament to vent their anger at Pedro Sanchez. What I'm asking for is respect for Spanish citizens, respect for our rights and respect for the Spanish constitution because we're here to demand our rights and the first is Spain. Spain's acting prime minister is in the hot seat over his controversial deal to grant amnesty to those Catalan separatists involved in the failed bid to secede from Spain in 2017. In exchange for the agreement, Sanchez gains the support of two key Catalan separatist parties, which will give him enough seats to form a governing coalition. Earlier in Parliament on Wednesday, Sanchez defended the arrangement, saying it was necessary to heal Spain's wounds. We have opted for the path of dialogue. We have opted for the path of forgiveness. We have opted for the path of understanding, even though it is very difficult because the positions are very different. We have put negotiation before imposition, but we have put reunion before revenge. In short, unity before fracture. What has people upset is the possible return of Carlos Puigdemont, the man who spearheaded the illegal independence vote. Many Spaniards consider him a traitor. He's a fugitive from Spanish law living in exile in Brussels. The opposition has accused Sanchez of selling out Spain to stay in power, and they've called for more protests.